problema. <risa> Gracias. So remember last week when I was all excited to announce this, I did discover the problem and hence the solution. So if you bear with me, I'll explain it. Well, people kind of pointed out that I never addressed that thing in my whole video. So um, I think this week is the time to address the diesel heater again. Let's roll the clip. It's my Let's do this. So I'm guessing the problem is not at the bottom, but it'll be at the top. Isn't that always the case? Let's go and check it out. So um, can I just remind you that I am really a newbie to van life. So um, bear with me or, uh, you know, don't hold it against me if I make basic mistakes, but the diesel heater. The diesel heater runs on diesel, at least that's what I thought, but it needs electricity. And the electricity comes from the solar panel, as you see here. <sighs> now, I only draw power through solar. I know I have a board battery that could also supply me with, but I've got two systems. The board battery at the front is just for the car, and the battery at the back is solar powered and is only for the living section of my van. I thought that was a clever idea, maybe not. Because when you're in the Pyrenees or when you're driving from Berlin all the way down France with bad weather, no sun, only clouds and snow in the end, the solar doesn't really draw a lot of power from the sun obviously hence your battery isn't full hence the diesel heater although i thought it was running on diesel which it is but you know it needs electricity as well for, to ignite and the ignition itself apparently draws a lot of energy so um my battery couldn't handle it so it shut down and hence no heating And you might say, well, you're in a sunny area now. You don't need your diesel heater anymore. Uh, you might be right, but the, what I found is the, um, the mornings and the evenings are very, very chilly. Not as minus three like in Berlin, but hey, they're still chilly and a little warm up in the morning and before going to bed is perfect. So there you go. That is the mystery that I solved of the diesel heater. Okay. Now that we finally cover that, um, I think it's time to hit the road. Somebody pointed out like, hey, you're a van lifer. Show us the van or show us a road at least. 
So today I'm taking you, I'm taking myself even to Valencia. And I keep on saying Valencia and the Spanish pronunciation is with a B. So it's Valencia. So um, come along and let's drive to sunny Valencia. <laughs> 